Hey guys, it's Dan from SpareTireRunning.com, day um, 86. So the other day, I uh, talked about a baby and praying for the baby. Well, the baby didn't, didn't survive. Um, the baby passed away. There was her funeral coming up next week um, on Tuesday. It, uh, the parents have decided to, uh, you know, donate, um, all the organs uh, as much as they can to other babies that are, are struggling, which I thought was encouraging, kind, and strength, you know, how can you have the strength at that time to make a decision like that? Um, there are probably better people than I am in that point because I don't know if I could have been that strong. And all this, um, and especially this time of the year, um, is reminds me of, uh, of of Kayla, Ryan's baby that passed away. Um, March twenty fourth. It's always been an important date in my life as it's Tommy's birthday. Um, but three years ago, on March 24th, um, we had the birth and death of a sweet baby girl. Um, and I know I mentioned this before, but uh, on the back of, that's why the back of our jerseys, our shirts, we have the, the angel that's uh, on there with us and and that's the uh, the angel that was on the door at the hospital um, that Ryan and his wife were at uh, when they gave birth and had to say goodbye. Um, it's very touching. I'm trying not to be emotional here, guys. I mean, you throw in Easter at this time, too. So, you talk about that death and life, and then Easter time is the epitome. Is that a word? The nature of life and death, death of Christ for the life of us. Um, it just again it goes back to what I was talking about more transcending beyond um, running. That was kind of weird. Really. Lock my doors. I don't know if you guys saw that. I was kind of freaked out there for a second there. I'm going to want to play this back later and see if that was there when that car came up from behind. Let's see if this is not going to do it. Um, but that car came up from behind. I kind of swore I saw a person walking um, by me, by the car, and... I'm pretty, you know, the gym is pretty uh, light today. Yeah, it's being Saturday before Easter. Well, Saturdays are usually light. But uh, there's, and I parked pretty far away so I can get some extra steps in and kind of, kind of freaky. Anyways, um, talking about life and death, uh, miracles and, and everything. But uh, we run because we're fat we run because we like it we run because we're we are uh, um, trying to lose weight and have fun and be a team and and so what but there's so much more and that's why um, half the races we do we love doing these small races that uh, support uh, organizations and people um, let's see if it happens again no this car truck cars go the other way but uh like uh um, we're the one coming up this tech trek is helping a school out um for their technology program we have a library run bookworm run or something to help out a library we've done the nickel pickle um that's not on the schedule yet because i haven't seen any information on that miles for mankind is kind of like the same thing it helps out different stuff so we try to help out as as best as we can on some of these races um, 
but uh, it's still there's still more light to life than to just running. But as much as we love running and moving forward, we we know that, and hopefully you guys know that, and still support us throughout this. But I don't want to talk much longer. It's getting late. Uh, I need to get up early tomorrow. Oh yeah, even though it's Easter, um, we're gonna be grilling up some good steaks. Uh, I had to go grab some charcoal today. I had to drive to like two different stores to get that. But um, it is springtime. It's time for time to get the grill out and uh, start throwing up some steaks and hamburgers and brats. Um, all that lovely protein I love. So, all right. I'll talk to you guys later. Run hard. <laughs>